Hey everyone, hope you're well today. So today I'm going to do a quick video on how you find your wallet address on Binance. Okay, so it's pretty simple it is. Um, before we get into the video though, I want to give you a couple of very important bits of information. So if you listen to anything, please listen to this. Okay, firstly, um, every coin has its own unique wallet address. So for example, you cannot send Bitcoin to Bitcoin Cash. If you select that, you will lose all your coins, all of your money you will. Secondly, um, wherever you're sending, you may have a wallet somewhere else and you're sending it to Binance. If you are, you need to find out which network you're sending on. So if you're sending DOT, are you sending it on the DOT network? Are you sending it on the Ethereum network? Are you sending it on some other network? Every network will have an individual address as well as well. So the address for DOT on the DOT network will work will be different to the address for dot on the ethereum network if you get this wrong you will lose all of your coins so i can't emphasize that enough so it's really important if you're sending more than you're willing to lose i would recommend making a small transaction first to make sure it gets there and once it gets there then transfer the rest of your wallet okay now that we've got the scary stuff out of the way let's get into the video so let's find binance so we scroll to the binance app click on binance it might take a minute to load just simply because my network coverage isn't very good here apologies so once we get in here the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go and we're going to try and deposit um some crypto we are so it's loading now okay so what we're going to do is we're going to go down to the bottom right hand corner where it says wallets so where it is click on wallets okay so now we're in overview so where it says deposit the yellow button on my screen click on deposit so now you can deposit either crypto or fees so what we want to do is we want to deposit crypto so you can either type it in the search bar you can or you can scroll down through and find the coin you're looking for so as i said in my case i'm just going to pick dot i already have it here in my search history so let's click on dot okay so this is obviously a warning will come up every time it just says please note that we do not currently do not support deposits for staking rewards that's fine we don't want that so this is your wallet address for sending a dot on the dot network if you can see the top of my screen there's dot bep2 and there's all these different four different ones so if you if i click we're sending dot but if i click on different networks we can see here that the address will be different and also some of them require a memo so if you look down just underneath the address it says dot memo also if you forget to put this in and it's required again you will lose all of your crypto and all of your coins so again it's really important you need to know exactly which network you're sending it from you cannot be wrong or you lose everything so again if we go we can click and they're all different addresses uh, so let's go back and pick one that's something different so it'll be band just because i have it here and if you look at band what we'll notice is that the band wallet automatically comes up with a band memo so you need to remember you, this is your wallet address this is your band memo so you put it in the band network and um, you can also scan the barcode you can please make sure you use the copy and paste because it is really sensitive it is in that um, so that's how you find your wallet address. I hope it was helpful. And as I said, please be careful. Um, if you have any questions or that, just drop them in the comments and I will do my best to answer them. And um, if you can, please give the video a thumbs up. Uh, have, enjoy the rest of your evening.